just made such a good fun intro. I wasn't recording. So let's try this again. Hey, welcome back. If you're new here, nice to meet you. If you're not new here, nice to see you. Thank you for coming back. I really appreciate it. My hands are up. I lied to all of you. I lied. If you watched my first video, I said I wasn't creating book videos a lot. I wasn't gonna create them a lot, but I'm having fun. I did lie because this is another book video. The third one in a row. Is my next one gonna be a book video? Yeah, yeah. Is the one after that gonna be a book video? Yeah, yeah, I'm having fun. I'm gonna do what I like. I'm having fun, I'm gonna do what I want. But <laughs> if you are enjoying these book videos, thank you. I really appreciate it. I really, I really, 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 really appreciate it. If you wanna see something other than book videos, <laughs> let me know what you wanna see. But I don't really have any other plans other than book videos and maybe some vlogs. But my life is not interesting enough to vlog. If there's an echo in this room, ignore it. Thank you. I'm replacing my TikTok screen time with reading. I got this idea from Michaela Wilson here on YouTube. After you're done watching this video, go watch hers. It was entertaining. It was cool. It was great. I loved it. I got this video from her. I've seen a ton of people do replacing my screen time with reading, but I don't have the patience nor discipline to read for 10 plus hours for five days. I know I'm on my phone all the time, six, eight, 10 hours a day. I don't have the discipline or patience. I really don't. I can make, I, I get home from work. I can't read for that long. I'm being honest with you. So we're doing TikTok screen time. I could be doing something other than TikTok. I could be reading. I think I've been talking enough. We're doing this for five days, starting September 1st, Thursday replacing my TikTok screen time with reading. I hope you enjoy it. I hope this intro wasn't long enough for you to leave. So if you're still here after just the intro, love you. All right, let's do this. Welcome to the first day of replacing my TikTok screen time with reading. I'm so excited for the book that I'm reading today. I'm not reading anything off of my physical TBR. But I have plenty of things to read on my physical TBR. But guess what we're reading? They're vicious darlings. It came out today. Last week, Thursday, I was on TikTok for about an hour and 41 minutes. So today we're gonna read for an hour and 41 minutes, which honestly isn't that much if you think about it. It's only a 238 pages or something like that, which is really short. I think I could do it in a couple of hours. I don't think I'll finish it in an hour and 41 minutes. Who knows? I might really be into the book and finish it today. The world may never know except for in five minutes when this clip is over with and you know the last book left off on a cliffhanger a little itty bitty cliffhanger and thankfully i didn't have to wait that long unlike some people who have waited a while for this i think the last book was my huh? i think the last book was my favorite instead of talking anymore we're gonna go read this book and i'm gonna update y'all um when i update you i guess i'm gonna set a timer for an hour and 41 minutes I'll let you know. Hello, it's Friday, end of the work week. I'm tired, but we're gonna continue doing this. Today we have two hours and 20 minutes of reading. I got 43% of the way through yesterday with Their Vicious Darling. I'm pretty sure in the two hours and 20 minutes I can finish it. So we'll see about that. I'm loving the book so far. I wanted to update you guys yesterday, but it got really dark by the time I finished and I didn't want the lighting to be really absolutely disgusting. So I didn't update y'all. Anyways, let's get to reading today because we've got two hours and 20 minutes to get through and it's 4.47. Okay, so I just finished their vicious darlings. I finished my two hours and twenty minutes. Uh, while I was reading it, see, I thought this was the last book. While I was reading it, I was like, they really sped up the ending. I don't know. I don't know. And then the last sentence, I was like, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. There's going to be another book. When is it going to come out? No clue. But there's going to be another one. 
Anyways, I finished for today. I have no clue what I'm gonna read next. It's like a four star. I really like it. They're not like the greatest books ever, but they're just like really fun, easy reads. Hey, hey, it's another day of replacing my TikTok screen time with reading. Today's Saturday, and it's another two hour and 40 minute reading day. So exciting. I think the last place I filmed was a little too dark, so we're gonna refilm this clip. And I'm trying to decide what book I'm gonna read. I showed the legend. Hello, hi. You're right in front of the camera, girl. What are you doing? What are you doing? You're right in front of the camera. What are you doing? Yeah, nice to meet you. Anyways, I'm a de I'm deciding what book I want to read. I showed I just bought Legend today. Heard people compare it to Shatter Me series, and I'm not finished with the Shatter Me series. I don't want to start another one similar. So I'm gonna do some research. Why do my words sound so weird? I'm gonna do some research and figure out if it's like it. Cause if not, then we'll read this, and then I'm trying to decide what other book I should have on the table. I got all these from a garage sale. Oh, pretty girl, can you lay down? Thank you, what's a pretty girl? Anyways, I got these from a garage sale. Um, you keep sitting up, I'm trying to film something. Tell me you're mine. Um, that's not my bookmark, but I got a bookmark. And The Woman in the Cabin, and then I got Wicked. Not something I'm wanting to read right now, but I got it. This might be an option. We'll put that in that pile of options. What else do I have? I'm gonna do some research on these three books to decide, to decide which one I'm gonna read. So I'll be back with you my hands. For starters, The Woman in Cabin 10. Not The Woman in Cabin. I don't know what I was saying, but The Woman in Cabin, it's The Woman in Cabin 10. Quite honestly, doesn't have the greatest reviews and I don't wanna put myself in a slump right now, especially for this video. So we're gonna wait. I have a video planned for October for thrillers and stuff. So we'll wait for this one. Which one do you think I chose? Not this one. I <laughs> do want to read this. It's going to keep sitting on my TBR for I don't know how long. We're going to read Legend. I did look it up to see how it compared to Shatter Me, and I think it's just compared because they're dystopians. They're YA dystopians. Two hours and 40 minutes on the timer. Let's see how much I can get finished. All right, I'm gonna be honest with you. I didn't read for the amount of time I was supposed to yesterday. I started pretty late, so I only got about 60 pages in, and I read for about an hour and a half. I'm just gonna add that hour and 10 minutes onto today's time. I don't, I haven't looked at what today's time is yet, but I'm gonna read this now. And then I'm going to read today's time later. And I think today's time is like three hours. So we're reading for like four or seven hours. But we're going to read this right now for about an hour. And then I'll let you know how it's going. <laughs> me finishing off yesterday's time for today because I didn't do it yesterday I read for about an hour and some change an hour and 10 minutes I got to page 110 then I stopped last Sunday my screen time was three hours and 27 minutes so that's how I how much I have left for today I think I can finish this book today I like the book I'm not like shocked or like wowed or anything by the book but it is good I'm definitely really late to the game of reading. To the game of reading a lot of things. I didn't read when I was younger. And then I started reading a year ago. So I'm catching up on the, all the books that I didn't end up reading. So like The Hunger Game, Twilight, uh, Shatter Me, which is older, which a lot of people are reading now anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Harry Potter, Divergent, Maze Runner, all of like those dystopian type books. 
and then I'm reading popular books now. I'm trying to just venture out of the popular books. We're gonna move locations because this is kind of uncomfortable. Anyways, let's go read for three hours and 27 minutes. Am I gonna read consecutively? Probably not. I'll probably take like a break here and there, but I'll update you. We're hoping we finish this book today. Okay, it's been about, you know, the last time I filmed was a couple hours ago. I didn't read the entire three hours and 27 minutes. I read about two hours of legend. I got to 210, so I got 100 pages through in the two hours, I think. I have an hour, a little less than an hour left, I believe. I'm not quite sure. I like this book. It's just gotten to gotten to like a part that I'm like interested I think the next couple of books will probably be pulling my attention in <laughs> I read the synopsis and if you read the synopsis until June's brother is murdered so I knew her brother was gonna die but when he died I was still like shocked right I don't know if it's just me but I was still pretty shocked and then something else happened in here probably about 40 pages ago and I <laughs> jaw drops where they are now and i'm still have this much left i wonder what's gonna go down i have a predict i almost said predicament i have a prediction of what's gonna happen but that's still i think that can happen in the next 10 pages i'm gonna finish these next 100 pages and i am excited to know what's gonna happen and I'm excited to pick up another book. I feel like I might read another book today, even though it's going to be past my time. But I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to put on my timer. See what's left on my timer. And we'll go from there. be honest with you I've already been reading I've already read the time I'm, I'm, I'm supposed to read today which was about two hours and 20 minutes I've already read it I'm gonna keep reading now I'm reading sleep kitten right now I was really bored this morning and instead of being on my phone I wanted to read something so when I want to read something I look it up on TikTok how ironic right I wanted to read a sports romance specifically I saw a couple of videos they were all the same type of video which is there's a quote from the book and then it switches to that person in the car jumping up and down because they're so excited i looked up the i looked up the book on goodreads and it doesn't have great reviews it doesn't have the best reviews and i was like i'm gonna make my own assumption about this book i'm gonna read the book i'm loving this book i don't know why people hate it so much i'm loving it weird name weird cover but i like the book a lot and it makes sense maybe that something is gonna throw me off and i'm gonna hate the book but so far i do really like the book i'm gonna finish this book today i'm gonna keep reading this book i just wanted to let y'all know i just wanted to update you for the day it's monday in case i haven't already said that two hours and 20 minutes of reading i've already done it but we're just gonna finish this book <laughs> Welcome back to the last day. Whoop, whoop, whoop. It is the last day of replacing my TikTok screen time with reading. Told y'all I was gonna finish that book yesterday. I didn't finish that book yesterday. I have um, about 60, 70 pages left in the book. I told y'all I was loving it yesterday. Am I loving it today? Yes and no. I would say right now my feelings are, I really do still like the book. There's nothing that's really making me hate the book. But I'm not like in love with the book. There's a couple of things I could say we could change about the book. Like it's a instant lovey book. There's still nothing wrong with either of them. And with only that much left in the book, I'm sure we could get through something being wrong with them. It even says it in the book. She's like, there's nothing wrong with him. When is something gonna happen? because what is gonna happen? 
because if it's not that big of a deal then I don't know I still do like it there's nothing that's like I said making me hate the book making me dislike the book I think it's another romance book there's still some super cute parts in it I don't know we're gonna keep reading today I haven't even mentioned today I have two and a half hours of reading two hours and 30 minutes of reading I'm sure uh, in this amount of time I'll get the book done and start a new book I have two and a half hours left. I probably only have an hour left of reading, maybe. A little over an hour, I don't know. And then we'll decide what book I read next. So, let's go and do this two and a half hours of reading. Last day. Okay, I just finished Sleep Kitten. It was... Okay, I didn't hate it. I didn't love it. I think it was just a typical romance, typical hockey romance. It was cute. I think by the end I was kind of bored of it, honestly, because nothing was happening except for them being all lovey-dovey. And then something, I guess minor, it's not that minor. It's kind of the thing that like sets off everything where it, it's like they split, but then they obviously get back together. You know what I'm talking about. It wasn't a, mm, mm. I gave it a three stars. It was okay. I have about an hour left of reading today. Technically I've already read today. I just was reading at work. I don't know what I'm gonna read though. I will get back to you when I decide what I'm gonna read. I might just read another book on my iPad. I'll let you know what I'm reading or whenever I finished it. I'll keep you updated. I finished yesterday. I didn't record after I finished my book, but I did start reading Pen Pals. I was gonna read The Ravens. I can't think of who it's by right now, but I was gonna read that and then I decided to read Pen Pals and I'm about 30% through and it's pretty good so far. I'm liking it. It's weird. It's kind of weird. I don't really... I don't, I don't, I have no clue what it's about. I've just, I've, been, I've just been seeing it through like on TikTok and Goodreads. I decided I wanted to read it and I still don't know what it's about. I don't know if it's like a mystery romance or, but I did finish yesterday. I really, I enjoyed this little challenge that I did. It made me read more. I read as many books as I did last month, just the whole month of August in these couple of days. So I'm pretty proud of myself. I think it's gonna be a really good reading month. That just makes me wanna read more. I've, been, I've read every single day this month, which is not typically what I do. I read a book for a couple of days, I stop reading for a couple of days, and then I read another book. That's how I normally read. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, let me know. I had a lot of fun making it. I had a lot of fun reading. If you have any book suggestions that you want me to read, rather than what I did read, or any book videos or regular videos that you want to see, let me know. I had so much fun. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoy this video or enjoy me, follow my other socials. They'll be in the description. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.